Okay, first thing I'd like to do is would you introduce yourself? Uh, my name is Kat Mertz. I'm the head coach of St. Louis University. Welcome to St. Louis, Thank Coach. Thank you. Good to be here. Yeah, well, and I'm looking forward to seeing the results, especially after watching tonight's game. What'd you think? Uh, well, I thought it was a tale of two halves. Uh, first half, we were a little bit on our heels. Uh, you know, Mizzou's a great side. I mean, obviously uh, athletic, uh, very skilled. Um, you know, they put us under pressure in the first half, and our girls, our heads were spinning, and Second half, I think we took a breath and we started to connect the pass and we realized we could stretch them on the flanks and we had a lot of opportunities created on the flanks, which was nice. Um, and our girls gained some confidence with this game. So it was, it was, it was a good game for us. It was, it was a good looking crew. That was a crew that I could uh, be excited about promoting, quite frankly. It was, uh, I, well, you're the coach, you know better than <laughs> I do. So I won't argue too much, but the, the second half really was a nice improvement. And you came close, boy, 14. Yep. Put yeah. that one off the upright. Yeah, she had no. a couple more opportunities. She, she's a good one, and, and she's a threat. And I think, uh, you know, we're going to have to work with her every day to find a way that she can get the ball in more dangerous spots. You know, sometimes she finds it too far away from goal, or she tries to take an extra touch. And But we need to keep working on her every day. Well, and you're a uh, center mid from Wabansi Valley? 24? Yeah, 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 24. I don't know the no, numbers. No, I, I don't have the n The little know, one or the tall one or the, from Chicago? Uh, from, I, well, you know, I'm using the roster that was on the website. Okay. So she was, but she was your center mid the entire game and the she got up and all. Yes. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's Mary. 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 Uh, Mary Owens. Uh, no, excuse me, Mary Wright. Sorry, Mary there Wright. Go. There you go. Um, yeah, no, uh, you know, we, she stepped up in the second half. She did. She did. We played her as a center back, and then we had another player go down with mono, so we moved her in the attacking mm -hmm. center with role, and she's just really flourished in there, so right. it's nice to see Sort of sat back a little bit in the first half, but then the second half, she got more mobile and started taking it well, to Well, we them. addressed that in halftime. Uh, you know, Mizzou comes out in a 4-3, I mean, 3-4-3, three, three, and mm -hmm. our three central midfielders really needed to find the ball more, and they needed to connect with each other more, mm -hmm. um, and I thought they did a much better job in the second half with that. You've, uh, you've been with some pretty well-known programs, UCLA, <laughs> Texas. UNLV, I don't have much visibility on it, but <laughs> programs obviously that have had some success, But and now you've come here. Tell me a little bit about why you made that decision. Oh, uh, well, you look at this Herman Stadium, it's, it's pretty Ooh, obvious. It's pretty sweet, uh, isn't it's, it? It's a beautiful stadium. The facilities can stand um, against any program. For sure, and I think the A-10 is a good conference. Uh, right now on the women's side, we had two teams go to the NCAA tournament. And as a uh, coach, you're always looking for a conference that you're going to put teams into the NCAA tournament. So I mm -hmm. think the quality of soccer in the A-10 is good, and I feel like we can win that conference. Um, and then after that, St. Louis University is an excellent education uh, academic institution, and um, the kids are going to get a great valued education, and they're also going to come in and grow as a soccer athlete. And that's that's really why I took this job. Mm -hmm. It's 6,000 seats here. How yeah. do you fill them? Yeah. What, what type of things do you anticipate? we got to put a better product on the floor. And how do you get, go about <laughs> that? What, what's key? What's, uh, what's 2012 look like for it, you? You know, I think the uh, the game is uh, evolving, and we have to keep up with the game. Mm -hmm. um, you know, every day, you know, we talk about watching the game and being a student of the game, and there's so much soccer on TV right now. So we need to keep up with the times of soccer and, and play a more attractive style and, uh, you know, put basically goals in the back of the net and uh, and decrease the amount of goals in the back of our net um, but you know I've grown up on the west coast and you know did a lot of soccer out there so I want to put the ball down and play and possess the ball and try to pick teams apart and uh, really get around teams on the inline and score from flank play or just going right at them down the heart right well you uh, based upon what I saw tonight it was a, uh, a definite step in the right direction <laughs> I look forward to promoting the program. It was Perfect. nice. Well, I appreciate it. Thanks for coming out. Pleasure meeting you. It. Thank you.